Alright. Hi, guys. So, uh, today we're here with the winner of our Minikami Art Contest, uh, Gabriel, right? Yeah. Yeah, so, uh, honest, first of all, I guess, uh, go on and introduce yourself. Hi, I'm, uh, Gabriel. Uh, no pseudonym, that's my real name. Uh, I drew an entry for the contest, no? <laughs> well, you did draw an entry for the contest, but, uh, you know, all right, feel free to elaborate a little more. So, you know, uh, we'll start with something simple, like, when did you start getting into illustration? Uh, I guess, I mean, I've always drawn pretty much my whole life. Uh, I didn't start, like, really taking it more seriously till high school, but even then I didn't really take it that seriously until I, uh, after high school, I went to Vancouver Film School for a year, but I, cool. I dropped out. <laughs> But anyways, yeah, uh, so I've pretty much just been drawing my whole life. Oh, that's, that's, that's actually really cool. Um, is there, can you, can you think of any uh, like more influential moments uh, in terms of why you decided to keep going with this? Or has it just been something you've always enjoyed? Um, I think it's just something I've always enjoyed. Like, I always thought things like cartoons, anime, all that stuff was like, really cool. Like, uh, just growing up, I watched TV probably more than I went outside and you know I spent more time <laughs> I spent more time inside watching TV than like hanging out with don't worry don't worry we've all been there we, we live that life <laughs> we are kindred spirits recap a little bit you are the winner of our art contest and uh, your particular piece would <clears throat> it had a lot of energy there was a lot there was a um, like clear kind of pop out factor there and uh, I was just wondering uh, can you name anybody I guess who you would say has uh, been a significant influence on your style? Akira Toriyama from Dragon Ball, like just nice, classic sim simplicity, but just dynamic energy that comes from his art. And uh, I guess also really like uh, Yusuke Murata from uh, known for Ice Shield 21 and uh, more recently One Punch Man. Oh um, yeah, no, he does really good art. Yeah, yeah. Then this kind of leads up to a, this. This leads up to a nice segue to the next question because I was just about to ask um, what are some of your uh, favorite pieces of fiction then? Well, what was yours? Yeah, I mean, uh, I guess for anime, like, I like most of all what's most important for me, like, I guess it sounds really shallow, but visuals You're are, an artist, man. It's okay. Go on. Like, even if it has a crap start, if it looks really cool but <laughs> even you know, something that looks more simple, like, I'm not all about like, hyper-rendered like cool stuff like uh, like One Punch Man that I said. Like, yeah, I would like a just... word with you about that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> right. Like um, Zetsubo Sensei, um, but it's it's really stylish even though it's more minimalistic. I I really love stuff like that too. Yeah. yeah. Um, <laughs> with regards to like I guess more humor and writing and stuff though, I tend more to like more, I guess, Western stuff, like my favorite TV show of all time is Arrested Development. Nice, so, good choice. Well, that's like basically how I think, like, a lot of the visuals I like more, I guess, the Eastern, you know, stuff from mm. Asia. Yeah, yeah. Um, but I guess more, like, dialogue and writing-wise, I like Western stuff kind of a little more. No, that's fair, that's fair. Do uh, you want to, do you, do you have any particular reasons about uh, why you prefer the stuff you do? Um, I guess I'm just like, I just grew up like any other young boy, um, <laughs> hardwired to like robots and cool stuff, like explosions. Don't worry, you know, it's okay. I'm sure everyone, I'm sure most of the people who are attending Minikami at some point in their lives have tried to shoot a Kamehameha wave. <laughs> I know I've done it. It was terribly embarrassing. I'd still do it if it would work. <laughs> But yeah, no, I, I get where you're coming from with that. So it's just kind of, so I guess you, you just say it, it's kind of things are just uh, stuff you grew up with, right? And that's why you like them. Yeah. Pretty much. Yeah, no, that's fair, that's fair. All right, um, so then do you, uh, uh, since you're obviously going to be, uh, I'm assuming you're going to be attending the event. <laughs> obviously. So, on my um, table. All right, sure, go on. You know what? I'll give you like five seconds. Go. Throw an ad out. Uh, come to our table. Uh, we'll have great stuff. Uh, you heard it here first. Great stuff. Best table. Uh, forget all the other tables. You might want to tell them what the name of your table is. It's the Potato Friendship Society. <laughs> I didn't come up with that name, but you know what? It's there. We're, ha we're here. We're going to be there. 
uh, just, yeah. Uh, when you look at the uh, sheet of the layout of the uh, tables, just look for us. Don't care about the other ones. <laughs> Mini Comet does not publicly endorse this. This is all uh, artist opinion. Anyway, so uh, do, do you have any uh, more local artists that you're looking forward to meeting, or uh, you know some some local things that are coming up at the event itself that you're looking forward to? Um, I'm just excited to see like what everyone else brings to the table. Like, uh, like in all seriousness, I'm you know. I really do like how um, there's such a great art community here. Like everyone's so yeah. everyone's so friendly too. Like everyone's so talented, and friendly. And it's just great to see uh, what they all bring to the table. Like um, in all the times I've tabled before, like mm -hmm. not, well, not that many, but uh, <laughs> uh, you know, it's been great just to see up close. Even like seeing all them like even doing commissions on the spot and stuff. Like it's just great to see and stuff. Um, Yeah. yeah. <laughs> don't feel don't feel pressured. Don't feel pressured. Uh, I mean, do you, if if you don't have if you don't have any particular artists in mind at school, you can love the whole community. No one's gonna hate on you for that. I love everyone equally. Uh, I have a dream that everyone is gonna have a great thing for me. All right. For a second there, I thought we were gonna start infringing on copyright and <laughs> copyright problems because uh, you started that off really uh, Martin Luther King esque. Uh, so, thanks for sharing your thoughts with us. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. And uh, we will see you, and hopefully you, at Minicomic. Sorry. You better be there. <laughs>